Hey folks, Eric here at Avid, and I've got another quick tip for you. So um, on the main screen of CNC12, we give you options to jog around in X and Y and Z. We give you an option to go to X, Y, zero, and we also give an option to move your Z all the way up. But sometimes you might want to do something simple like just move to X, zero, or just move to Y, zero, or just move your Z axis down to one inch over your material. And you can do that with these jog commands, but it is, for example, here in Y, like if you want to get to Y zero, it's hard to do that accurately. Um, sometimes you have to go in incremental mode and kind of nudge the machine. Well, there's a much easier way to do it. So on the main screen, there's this button called MDI, and this stands for manual data input. And when you click it, you get a cursor that asks for a block. And in this block, you can type in G code. I know what you're thinking, I don't know G-code, I don't want to do programming. It's actually really easy. So let's say you want to go to X0, okay? If you just type in X0 and you press cycle start, you can see here the machine is going to move exactly to X0. And if I want to move to Y0, I just type in Y0 and press cycle start, and the machine is going to move exactly to Y0. So really, really simple. Um, let's say you want to move to Y5. Well, that's really easy too. Type in Y5 and hit cycle start and the machine will move exactly to Y5. Um, let's say you want to check your Z0 to see if you've accurately measured over the top of your material. Well, really simple too. I can type in Z1 and this will move the bit exactly one inch over my material. So I can check to see if that's right. Oftentimes I do this to make sure that I've remembered to touch off to the top of my material. I'll move it an inch over. If it looks like it's an inch over, I'll feel confident, go ahead to, and go to Z0, and this will put the bit right on top of my material, and I can visually see that my Z0 is set, and go ahead and run my job. So um, there you go, three commands that are really, really powerful and easy to remember in MDI. X0, Y0, Z0, or X followed by a number, Y followed by a number, or Z followed by a number. So hopefully you find MDI useful, and uh, as always, happy making.